Oh, look who's back in the mother flipping house. It's Pelly, your favorite nurse. Do you remember Joy Behar? Yeah, neither do I. Because she fucked with the nurses. And now look, nowhere. She's, I think she is selling insurance for the Geico. Now, there is a new Behar for the 2019. And her name is Maureen Walsh. She is some state senator from Washington. I did not even know that Washington was a state. I thought it was a D.C. And she said the nurses get plenty of breaks. And during the, most of the day, they are probably playing the cards. Okay, first of all, bitch, who plays cards anymore, okay? It's called Candy Crush, okay? Get into the 2000s. I don't know. Sometimes I come home from a long 12-hour day and I just can't get the day out of my head. You know, I keep reliving the shift. It's like a kind of PTSD. I'm like, you damn, I was so close and that bitch Beatrice made me go fish and then I lost the game. Yeah, that's not how it goes, bitch. I take a 30-minute break in minus one minute. Yeah, nursing is so much fun. We play cards. We, we, do the, we throw the bones. You know, we're playing, I'm like, bitch, dominoes, huh? In between coding bed four or cleaning out the poly on bed seven or having to avoid the punches on bed nine. You know what this woman, this Maureen Walsh remind me of? She's like every sundowning patient after 7 p.m. when the sun goes down, she's like, I, I punch you, you ugly kitty. I hate kitties. I'm racist against kitties, huh? And in the morning, they're like, ah, oh, hi. I'm ready to cooperate with everything that you do. And then at night they're like, all the nurses sit around playing cards all the time. Stop your sundowning, you crazy senator bitch. She looks like she came straight out of central casting for worst patient ever. She looks like she fell off the top of the Prescani tree and checked every single strongly disagree box on the way down until she hit the ground on the ugly stick. I don't love a hoe. But I will say this about Maureen Walsh. I love seeing a female senator break the glass ceiling because she's proving that we are equal as we are just as worthless and ineffective as the men. I have been a nurse for 33 years. Hmm? And I am lucky if I get to eat lunch and be in the same shift. Okay. She better hope that I'm not her nurse because I will be sure to play cards when it is time for her pain meds and her turkey sandwich. I'm like, you want to see my poker face? Now I'm going to poke her face with a 14 gauge needle, okay? I mean, really though, I'm so surprised to see an elected official so utterly clueless about the real world. Hmm? This is my surprised face. Surprised. You know, come to think a bit, maybe Maureen is right. I did play strip poker with a homeless man named Grizz the other day in the ER. He threatened to take off all his clothes and take a dump on the floor. So, yeah, maybe nothing like strip poker. Maureen? Hmm? The Joker is not wild here, no. Mm -mm. I will quote the late, great Kenny Rogers. You never count your votes. When your name is Maureen Welch, there'll be time enough for counting. Never because no one's going to vote for you because nurses are going to destroy your career. Wow.